Following the destruction of the first Death Star, construction of the second Death Star immediately began, but how did the Empire keep the project a secret? Under the codename Second Sun, Moff Tian Jirgerod oversaw construction of the second Death Star, which began over the forest moon of Endo because of how remote the moon was. For security purposes, all staff were assigned to the construction site for the duration of the project, without any leave or secondary assignments. Because of this, many personnel brought their families with them. Additionally, all incoming and outgoing transmissions were approved, logged, and secured with a unique code that changed twice a day. Any communications sent outside of that protocol were automatically flagged and traced, and the construction location was isolated from most of the Imperial Holonet channels. All supplies were delivered to secure locations, picked up by personnel, and then brought to the construction site without delivery pilots ever knowing the final location of the supplies. The Empire also employed a robust staff of internal security personnel, droid surveillance, and bounties were offered to personnel for reporting transgressions of any kind amongst their fellow workers.